Hi everybody, this is Julie with ReadySetStamp.com and today we are going to be making a cute little lighthouse card. The card itself um, doesn't really make the shape of a card, if that makes any sense. Basically, this is the entire card. It looks like this and then you write on the back of it, but I think I'm actually going to attach this to a card and turn this into a bigger card. So let's get started with this. I just need some ATG tape on the back of this piece of paper here and I'm going to add that right to the back of this here. This needs to go down to the bottom and then now what I'm going to do is, actually I was supposed to glue that around there, whoops, that worked out well. There we go. Now what I'm going to do is add on a cute little lighthouse here, a little here along the sides too I think. It needs a little bit of glue here. Now I'm going to glue this right on, there we go. Now the next step that we're going to do is add on the little white piece and that goes in the middle here. Okay, so now I'm going to add on the little white piece that goes on here. Then I'm going to add on the little red piece that goes down below here. And I'm not quite sure how this red piece goes to be honest because I've never made this card before and it looks like it's too long so it must I don't quite understand how it's meant to work so I'm just going to trim this little piece off and see if I can get it to fit here properly. Oh yeah, I kind of like that. I'll just use my little tweezers here. Add that glue right here. I'm noticing I got a little bit too much glue. Okay, so we'll add the glue right here and we need to add the top part to it which is this little guy here that's going to go up like that. I'm going to get a little bit of glue here. To the base of this and we'll add that right there to the top. Let's move on to the next part here. Okay so I went ahead and added a cute little sentiment from the Scrappy Mom stamps and it says love you and I added these cute little fish brads and the little brad um, anchor here and I took off the brad part and just glued it on so it's still pretty, it's not on there really solid right now because it's only been gluing for just a little bit. I did use my glossy accents to adhere it. And this is, the tip is from Scrap, C-R-A-P-E-R-F-E-C-T, Scrap Perfect. And this is a medium tip that goes on this one. And if you guys were interested, it was a large tip that goes on this Scotch one. And I love it because I never have to waste mine anymore. They always, um, never dry up so it's really nice all right let's get started with the card base so here's this and let me add this part onto here this is really cute paper this is from die cuts with oh not die cuts with you sorry this is from Michaels and this was their nautical stack that they had a while back I bought two of them because I love them so much so I'm just gonna add a couple of things here of the not the glue but the tape We'll add that right onto here and get this card adhered. There we go. And now I've got the stripe paper that's from that same stack that's going to go on top. Looking good. And now we're just going to glue this right onto here. I just felt it was too small on itself, so I really wanted to make it be kind of the center of the show here. This is going to be a little tricky because I want to tape on the back of this and I'm afraid with these that they haven't quite glued down yet, so wish me luck on this one. <laughs> I love the way this card turned out. Oh, I love everything nautical, so very cute. So what I'm going to do is just add a little bit more glossy accents to the back of this little guy because it came off. Now you guys can see how I cut off the brad part of it there. And so I'll just glue it back on 